What is up? What is up? What is up, FS Club? Guess what, guys? New mods finally dropped on console. Yes, 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 yes. Let's take a look at these guys. We have the new mods. We have the B402. We have a couple of bail forks, Amazon UH UX5200, and Olive Tree. So that is the new mods. Okay, let's take a look at the first one, which is the coupler bail forks. Uh, pretty nice ones. They're uh, four slots, $450. Uh, when you hook them on, those things unfold. Pretty, pretty cool. Okay, let's go and check these out real quick. You go over here, go to, not to this one. So don't go over there. Uh, go to bailing technology, go all the way down. And there we are, the coupler bell forks, $450. You can change the design color from red, green, black, or it says scratch, but it looks like white to me. Uh, main color is red or green, and you have design one. And then design two adds like a little bitty thing over there. Pretty nice little mod right there. Okay, so that is the coupler bail forks. Next we have is the B402 disc harrows uh, for Schritz. Pretty nice ones. I mean, uh, they are, let's see, uh, Five slots, $13,000, and 3.0 meter working width. So pretty nice little ones. Uh, let's take a look at them. Uh, go under, I believe it's under disc arrows, yes. Go all the way over. And then they are B402, 13,000. Requires 80 horsepower, guys. So make sure you have that 80 horsepower. Pretty much any tractor in FS19 pretty much has that 80 horsepower. Oops, nope, no, not that. Uh, you have rim color. You can change it to pretty much any color you want to, so it changes the color of the rim on the wheels. Design, you have either standard, brown, or green. So there's the choices on that. And we have the green and blue one right here. Pretty nice little mod. Okay, then we have a pack, which is actually uh, the Amazon UX5200 pack. Uh, you guys might be saying, hey, those look pretty much the same. Well, they kind of are the same. The only thing that's different is the width, the width of the sprayers. Uh, let's see, they are five slots a piece, uh, ranges from $75,000 to $120,000. And the working width is, let's see, 24 meters to I think it's 40 meters. Yes, 40 meters. So yeah, I mean, they actually they do look a little bit different. I mean, just a little bit. It's just the boom mostly. So pretty nice. You uh, go over here, go to, I believe it's under crop protection. Yes, yeah, so they all are right there. Uh, you can change it from standard or to narrow tires, which I don't know why, but it doesn't show up as well set up as narrow tires on the selection thing. So, so that might be a little bug on there. Uh, pretty nice though, pretty, pretty nice. Okay, so those are the Amazon UX5200. The last thing we have is a placeable mod. And that is olive tree, which kind of looks like it's a dead olive tree. <laughs> uh, it's two slots, $1,000. And if you're playing on farm manager mode, I believe it's 90. Start from scratch is 50. And I think uh, the new farmer is 150. I believe it is. Uh, yeah, but this is it right here. Uh, let me actually, let me actually make time go by real fast to make sure everything is working okay. Because for some reason it doesn't show that do we have to put stuff in it? Yes, okay, good. You have to put water level and manure level. So uh, actually we'll go and do that really quick and see how it looks. Okay, here we go. Okay, we're putting manure in there and now we're gonna go fill these things up. I already put water in there. It only takes 100 water, so not too bad. So let's see what happens when we put the manure in there. If I can get the, oh, there it is. Okay, uh, put the help window on. Okay, it takes 500 manure. Okay, and we should start getting some money now. 48.50. Yep, got some money. Okay, put manure in there. Okay. Okay, so there are those mods right there. I don't see no olives or anything growing on them, but still pretty nice mod. Uh, let me turn that off. Okay guys, so that is the mods today. We got some fertilization, we got some uh, disc arrows, we got a couple of bell forks, and we got olive trees. Let me know which one is your guys' favorite in the comment section below. Guys, if you did like the video, make sure you guys pound that like button. If you have not said, make sure you guys do. 
And like always, farmers, have an all stay. Peace.